a very good afternoon to y'all and welcome back to the vlogs y'all it has been a long time my loves an extremely long time luca stop running around please <laughs> but we are back at it um i still don't have internet but i did get that long-awaited vlog of tasia graduating up it took three hours it took three hours i kid you not if you follow me on snapchat you will see that that is true but that was also a 17 minute video so hopefully that's not gonna be the usual but um basically what happened what i'm gonna be doing sorry i'm feeding the you guys i gotta get this seat down for a moment but basically what i'm planning on doing is um vlogging about four i mean about five or six days out of the week and then splitting splitting those vlogs up into two vlogs and then uploading twice a week so basically oh well, i forgot i had left this on i was washing jeans and i paused it because the noise was like bothering him and yeah i forgot that was on anyway so yeah, basically you'll get two vlogs a week, but it will be like three days in each vlog, more than likely. First of all, I missed y'all so fucking much. Second of all, I'm unemployed right now. I'm technically still employed at for at my job. Oh, I just almost said the name. I tried it. <laughs> at my job uh, that I was working at, you know, when the vlogs were still going on. But they don't have any work for the summer if you guys missed those update videos that I posted. Uh, Luca, get back here, eat your food. They don't have any work for the summer. And so, therefore, I am without employment. Um, I applied at Speedway, which is a gas station. They hired me. And then I decided not to take the job because I read up a little bit on what happens at Speedway and how they treat their employees and, like, all the work that you're assigned for a really low pay. So I decided to not take that. I also Look yeah. Now walking time for Luca, which actually just means pull time for Luca. He's gonna pull me because he is a psychopath. And that's what he does. There were people on uh, the other side of the street, so I decided to cross just because sometimes Luca can be very temperamental with people. Sometimes he's really like okay with them. Tay, I don't know if you guys can hear me because of the wind. Tasia's friend, uh, Brianna. Luca, wait. Wait. Tasia's friend came over um, the other day and he had never met her before. And he barked at first because he's a psycho. But then once we like get let him like go over by her, he was totally cool. She became like his best friend. It was so cute. And then my friends came over yesterday and uh, my friend's girlfriend who Luca has actually never met he's met my friends before but he's never met um, uh, Allie's girlfriend so she came over and they all came over and they actually approached us approached us while we were outside I was in the middle of walking him and they walked up on us and he was totally okay with it. Like, so I did change a few things in my bedroom that's the same I put my What's that called? This is my ottoman that was over there. I put it over here, and my garbage can is over here. And I moved that thing that I had in the middle that was holding my fan. Lucas Cage is still over there, closet, bed, whatever. And then my, I'm, this is obviously not like an official thing because we're still not doing room tours yet. Um, so I moved this over here under my TV because I just thought it looked better. I will be removing that shelf thing like I did the other one. Jim actually bought me two dozen roses. It was a late birthday present and they are stunning. I mean, I'm these things they take the cake, man. They take the cake for just gorgeousness. Right. Before I go, before I go, I finally got the Night Moth pencil from MAC. I've been wanting this Night Moth lip pencil for so long and i wasn't able to get it because jada was like roll blocking the shit out of me with this but i finally got it and it is so cute oh my gosh you guys like the lipstick junkie in me is so happy 
So while my camera was charging, it's still not all the way charged, I decided to do some organization, some organizing. Um, I have to like, that's a mess. But basically I took most of my hair products um, and just put them in this bin and kind of like organize them. So I have my Cantu deep mask and leave-in conditioner, my Cantu curl activator and shampoo, some face cream, some oil, my Eco Styler. And then under here I have these two new products, which is my Shea Moisture um, Curl Defining Smoothie and then my 10 in 1 Hair Mask by Shea Moisture. Then I have like my knockoff Denman brush over there. And so I decided to like get that nice and organized so I can like always get my, always reach my hair products. So I'm hoping that this system works because the system that I had before was trash. Okay, so I have a pretty important question for you guys, so I would really love it if you would respond in the comments below. So, my room is always a work in progress. I'm always changing it up. And if you've been following me for a while, you know that I really wanted to put an oversized mirror in this corner over here. But because Luca is here and that's his area, I can't do that any longer. So I'm thinking about putting it right here in this space between that ottoman and my desk. If you guys want to see the layout a little bit of my room, I'll go ahead and give you like a sweep over desk and then bookshelf. So I don't want my room to look crowded the way that my last room was. That's what I'm asking you. So anyway, I'll have a different headboard. I'll have a white headboard, but that's not really important at this point. Uh, this ottoman is going to be 86 and I'm going to switch that out for a small white um, nightstand. I already have one that I want. I just can't buy it right now so that's what's gonna be over there and then I want to put like an oversized mirror in this area right here but I don't want the room to look too crowded this chair is always pushed in so I don't want the room to look too crowded so I want to know do you guys think that putting a mirror right there will be like ideal do you think it will look right I know the mirrors open up the space so that's kind of what I'm going for so let me know <laughs> Can I hold the TT? I never no. hold it before. Um, I, you're lying. We are about to run over to Taco Bell to get some tacos because I have been craving them tacos and I need them in my life, child. Yeah, let me see. Wait, Tasia. I need the tacos, man. I need the tacos. Should I be going? Yeah, I should be going this way. Yeah. Okay, I don't know how to. Am I holding it right? <sighs> myself in there so I guess I don't know I never held it before yes I have I have held it hello TT's vlog you guys know me Tasia that was her graduation that you got that I just posted the vlog of so yeah that was my graduation <laughs> that was my graduation you know I'm in high school now yeah. okay of course Okay, I got my Taco Bell, and now we are about to head home. I have two viewers. And one viewer. shit, I gotta take Luca out, dude. That dog rules my life. I, I swear to God. I thought it was only fifteen percent. I thought it was only five. Seatbelt. Just put your seatbelt on. Already. No, no seatbelt. Oh yes, seatbelt. You ride in my damn car. Oh, he gave it to me every day, every day. Let this window down because I'm going to die up in here alone. Then ain't a word. Okay, back to Chance of Day two of the box, guys. What's up? Um, I'm not going to do the intro every day because I'm not going to do the intro every day because I feel like that'll get really repetitive. So I'll do it the first day of the vlog and then that'll be it. So you get a one, a very good afternoon to y'all. And then the rest will be just regular bloggity. Right now, I'm about to get fix myself a fine beverage. It's a nature shot. There's an animal who is in his natural habitat. He's just lying down, relaxing. There it goes. He's starting. Is he gonna stop moving? I don't know. He's he's looking a little. Confused and upset. There's something in his face. I don't know what it is. Um, he looks, he looks bored. 
So I didn't get to see Grease Live when it aired on Fox, I think. But I'm watching it now because I am such a fan of Grease. Grease is the shit. Uh, I do like the original better. The original was definitely goat. But um, this one is okay. Hello. Uh, so basically me and Tasia are playing this own kind of made up version of Hot Potato with Lucas Ball. So I'm just going to record it. <laughs> stuck outside <laughs> I don't know who this someone is but she's like really conceited sorry we can't have company today you have to go home Please. I'm outside with no shoes on because I'm ratchet because she's super ratchet it feels so good out here though you want to have a picnic TT no, I don't like you. No, I will have a picnic. I've never actually come out here and just kind of like walk around without Luca. <sighs> Especially like not with my shoes off. The grass is half dead though. So. It kind of hurt. <laughs> kind of hurt. A little bit. <laughs> it's a little bit more alive right here. Oh, it felt nice oh, right here. Yeah. <sighs> oh, look at the selfie lighting, y'all. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this little. Look at, don't bite my cover. I'm talking to my camera. Me and Tasia were building houses on The Sims. I, I'm done with my house, so I took a little time to lay in my bed. And this dude has just stopped biting my cover. This dude is just like laying here, biting my cover, chilling out. Go ahead and end this vlog here. Bye, buddy. You guys do and say thank you so much for watching. If you're watching, comment, like, subscribe if you wanna. Be sure to share with a friend because this is how these things grow. I love you guys so much. And I will see your beautiful souls soon. And remember, stay fabulous. Bye, you guys. Bye.